So let's talk about the YouTube partner program. Hey guys, Ben here. The whole policy change thing on YouTube with the needing 1,000 subs and 4,000 watch hours, it sucks. It really does whenever you don't have that many and you don't get that many views. But uh, I think overall that's going to be a good change. I remember I've been on YouTube for a while. I've had my account. I've had two other accounts before this uh, one that I'm using right now. So I've been using YouTube since about 2007, maybe even 2006, just using it without an account. So I've been able to see YouTube really grow for the better part of 11 or 12 years now. I've seen YouTube before the YouTube Partner Program, and I've seen the Partner Program come up, and I've seen channels change. I can remember back whenever I first got an email on one of my videos on another channel, giving me the opportunity to monetize that video back whenever they used to allow you to monetize a video, specifically a video without without having it be on your entire channel. That was back whenever... Uh, it was based on views and the more views that it saw a video of yours getting the more likely you were to be able to monetize that video specifically but after I got that email I can remember looking at uh, other YouTube channels and being like man I can't wait to be able to get partners so that way I can customize my channel and have a banner and stuff back before the channel one thing came out I mean I can even I can even look back and remember whenever a friend of mine, he got YouTube Partner back before they uh, changed it so that everyone can get it. And I can only imagine what he must have felt like to think that he worked so hard to be able to finally have YouTube Partner and then YouTube just decided to open it to everyone. So I think this change, I think this policy change is going to actually be a really good thing because how I've noticed many people saying that it'll now allow the ad money to be in a smaller group of people, thus allowing people that are actually making money from ads to make more money, because, or in theory, to make more money because there's fewer people for that ad money to kind of spread around. It'll kind of weed out the people that are just kind of doing it just to make money. I'll say that if you're not doing it just for the money, it is going to suck to lose that little bit of money because as Boogie has said in his video, I'll put a link to it in the description in case you haven't seen it. As Boogie has said, that first hundred dollars can change your life for the most part and it'll suck to do it for free for a while but if you're really dedicated at it you can do it i'm still going to be trying to grind on this channel trying to you know do that grind game get that grind game up and uh see if i can't grow this channel regardless of whether i'm making money or not i want to see this channel grow more than a thousand subs i want to be able to go out i want to be able to go out and enjoy life and film it and take you guys that are watching along for that ride because I love making videos I really really do it sucks it really does but this I think is the best thing for everyone in terms of changing the requirements all that being said if you would like to subscribe to this channel I do try to put out new videos every Wednesday slash Thursday and uh yeah I hope you decide to subscribe if you do awesome you're in for a ride and along with subscribing while you're down there, make sure you like the video or just give it a rating one way or the other. And comment, maybe maybe tell me your thoughts on this whole thing. Is this, are you a YouTuber? Is this going to affect you? Uh, do you think it's going to be a good thing or a bad thing? Yeah. So, overall, thanks for watching the video and uh, we'll see where this goes. <laughs> Have a fantastic day.